Yogurts are a basket of 17 naturally occurring elements comprised of 15 elements in the lanthanide series, plus yttrium and scandium. Other than scandium, all rare earths can be divided into heavy and light categories based on their atomic weight. Heavy rare earths are generally more sought after, but light rare earth elements can of course be important too. Here is a list of rare earth metals found in the world. Lanthanum, cerium, praseodymium, neodymium, promethium, samarium, europium, gadolinium, terbium, dysprosium, homium, erbium, thulium, iterbium, lutetium, scandium, and yttrium. What are the most technologically useful rare earth metals? Rare earth metals play a significant role in the development of various technologies. They are often used in electronics such as laptops and smartphones. Rare earth oxides such as neodymium and praseodymium are used in magnets, aircraft engines, and green technologies, including wind turbines and electric vehicles. Samarium and dysprosium also used in rare earth magnets. Phosphor rare earths such as europium, terbium and yttrium are used in lighting, as are cerium, lanthanum and gadolinium. But with supply chain worries rising in the rare earth element space, it's worth looking at which countries have the highest reserves. While in many cases the world's major rare earths mining countries hold large amounts of reserves, some countries have low rare earths production and high reserves. Case in point, mines in Vietnam produced only 400 metric tons of rare earth elements in 2021, but the nation's reserves are the second highest in the world. It's possible that countries like this could become bigger players in the space in the future. Under the Biden administration, the United States is looking to increase its own production to meet domestic requirements. On that note, here's an overview of rare earths reserves by country with a focus on the eight countries whose reserves are over 1 million metric tons. 1. China Reserves 44 million metric tons Unsurprisingly, China has the highest reserves of rare earth minerals at 44 million metric tons. The country was also the world's leading rare earths producer in 2021 by a long shot putting out 168,000 metric tons. Despite its top position, China remains focused on ensuring that its reserves remain elevated. Back in 2012, the Asian nation declared that its rare earths reserves were declining. It then announced in 2016 that it would raise domestic reserves by establishing both commercial and national stockpiles. The last decade has also seen the country hone in on illegal rare earths mining, taking steps such as shutting illegal or environmentally non-compliant rare earths mines and limiting production and exports. China's stern measures have cleaned up its supply chain significantly, although it continues to improve regulation and supervision. China's dominance in both rare earth elements production and reserves has caused problems in the past. Rare earths prices surged when the country cut exports in 2010, resulting in a rush to secure supply of the minerals elsewhere. 2. Vietnam Reserves 22 million metric tons Vietnam's rare earths reserves stand at 22 million metric tons. It reportedly hosts several deposits with concentrations against its northwestern border with China and along its eastern coastline. The majority of rare earths in the country can be found in primary ore deposits, with a smaller amount located in coastal placer deposits. As mentioned, Vietnam's rare earths production was minuscule in 2021 at 400 metric tons, a more than 40% drop from its 2020 output of 700 metric tons. However, Vietnam is interested in building its clean energy capacity and is said to be looking to produce more rare earths for that reason. 3. Brazil and Russia Reserves 21 million metric tons Brazil and Russia are tied for third largest rare earths reserves globally. Brazil was not a major producer of rare earths in 2021, with production clocking in at just 500 metric tons. A rare earths deposit worth US $8.4 billion was found in 2012 in the country, although not much has come out of the discovery. Russia produced 2,700 metric tons of rare earths in 2021, more than Brazil, and Vietnam. The Russian government has plans to invest US $1.5 billion in order to compete with China in the rare earths market. Russia's invasion of Ukraine has caused some concern over possible disruptions to the rare earth supply chain in the US and Europe. 4. India Reserves 6.9 million metric tons India's rare earths reserves sit at 6.9 million metric tons and it produced 2,900 metric tons of rare earths in 2021. However, there are reasons to believe the country's rare earths industry has further potential. India has nearly 35% of the world's beach and sand mineral deposits, which are significant sources of rare earths. 
5. Australia reserves 4 million metric tons. While Australia was the fourth largest rare earths mining country in 2021 at 22,000 metric tons of production, it has the fifth largest reserves in the world. Currently, its reserves stand at 4 million metric tons. Rare earths have only been mined in Australia since 2007, but extraction is expected to increase moving forward. Lena's Rare Earths operates the Mount Weld Mine and Concentration Plant in the country. It also runs a rare earths refining and processing facility in Malaysia. The company is considered the world's largest non-Chinese rare earth supplier. 6. United States Reserves 1.8 million metric tons While the U.S. reported the second highest output of rare earths in 2021 at 43,000 metric tons, the country takes the sixth top spot in global rare earths reserves. Rare earths mining in the U.S. now happens only at California's Mountain Pass Mine. In February 2021, President Joe Biden signed an executive order aimed at reviewing shortcomings in America's domestic supply chains for rare earths, medical devices, computer chips, and other critical resources. The next month, the U.S. Department of Energy announced a U.S. $30 million initiative to research and secure domestic supply chains for rare earths and battery metals such as cobalt and lithium. 7. Greenland Reserves 1.5 million metric tons Although Greenland's rare earths reserves are near the number held in the U.S., the island nation hasn't made much of an effort to bring them into production. The country's current government ran on a platform that included cancelling the island nation's only rare earths mining project. Thank you for watching this video produced by the clever producer Mr. Wonderful. We will publish these videos every single day. Please subscribe to this channel to receive many more videos about the globe. This is Around the Globe.